Hey guys, so I know I kind of already unboxed-ish the Golden Child Yes album, um, but this is the full box set. So every single member's book is in here. Um, I already went through the postcards, but you get them again. So I will set those aside. And let's just open this thing up. Comes in a nice box. You bought the set. I ended up getting the set on eBay. Because um, I didn't... I guess I didn't back it in time or didn't notice it when I first ordered mine. But just pull it all out here. Oop. All right. Oop. So here is the tag. I don't recognize every member's signature, so I'm not going to know <laughs> whose is whose. Oh, so there it is. What is it? Dayul. Let's see the signature. Matches. So I wonder if I'll get it because I have that member's book, if that'll be the same throughout them all. Guess I'll have to wait and see. And then it looks like they're going to have their own CD plates, too. Alright, so I'm just going to slide these back into the box as we go. Uh -huh. And then Y is my bias. Just zoom this out a little bit. Two tags seemed pretty stuck. Oh, and they must be wise because it looks like it has their name down here. I just am noticing that. So, so far it seems the member you get is the ones you'll get, which is fine by me. That means I'll have a complete collection. Because <laughs> uh. I know it was random when I got the random members. outfit. I just love Wise voice. That's why he was my favorite. Because usually I seem to always end up with a rapper, so it's very rare my bias is a singer. Ooh, look how pretty that is. Okay, and then photo card. Okay, and then I don't know if we can keep pulling these off because you can kind of already see it sitting in there. Alright, this one is, I don't know, I'm going to butcher his name and I don't want to. <laughs> Oh, there's his tag. Ooh, 
Oop, photo card. I'm not sure if this is the case for all that, or if you only bought the box set that you get the members whose you have. So if you bought the box set as well, let me know if yours ended up the same. Or if you bought a random one, if the member you got was the cards you got. Because I'm quite interested to see if that's how they did it. It would be kind of easier and nice. <laughs> you know, being like, I'm buying my bias member's book. And then you get all of his photo cards and stuff. I wonder if one of these is going to be like a, a group book. Because there was that one thicker um, piece. Uh, there's the CD plate. You have tags. Ooh, look at that necklace. Ooh, right here in the front. Tags, tag. And his photo card. Ooh, come here. There we go. Loving these jackets with like these pieces coming down. Remember when they did their kingdom performance? Tagged it this like leg fan kick thing. I was like, oh, MJ, he's more flexible than I am. is an intense choker on him too. CD plate. Okay. Sungmin. So it looks like his two cards are here in the front along with the tag. I mean, it has to be hard as a stylist to style for such large groups. Because they usually have like similar outfitting and then you gotta like change the length of someone's jacket, add a little different, have colors cut dip to try and so it's everyone's kind of slightly different and not in the exact same thing. Oh, props to them. Because <laughs> I think I'd be like, nope, <laughs> I'm just gonna put you all in the same outfit. <laughs> There's gonna be three options. Uh But one outfit thing I've been loving that Hong Joon from ATs did for a while is like this half skirt piece. Oh, I love it. I think, I think there's a, quite a few other members and groups that would look amazing in it. I guess I accidentally got two in this one. I will not complain. It's usually a rare occurrence, so thank you, K-pop gods. <laughs> uh, okay. I 
think this member is the one I got. Um, Jay Hyun. I believe his was the random one I got. We'll flip through it anyways. So if you just want to watch this one video, you can. I love his hair though. Maybe I should see if I should can do my hair that way. Because right now my hair is kind of like a 50-50 thing. It's very blonde on top and then dark underneath. But I'm loving this like mix. Ooh, buddy. Is he not wearing a shirt? Or is this some sheer thing? <sighs> Ooh, I love his jacket. Okay. We have G nope. Names are my kryptonite, so I'm not even gonna try to butcher it. <laughs> I'd feel too bad. I remember back when I first started collecting Got Seven, I could never get Yu Gi Oh's name right. So a lot of people who watched me caught on that I'd always skip saying his name. <laughs> I would go through the unboxings because I'd like say every other member's name <sighs> and they all taught me in the comments so I practiced and I have it because for me it's like repetition so I kind of remember names and things like that because I, I mean I do collect quite a lot of groups and a lot of them have a lot of members, and sometimes it's just hard for my brain. My brain can only retain so much. I really like this paper they used. It's so nice. Right, and there's our CD. Right. Tag for Donghyun. Donghyun. Oop. Photo card. And the next one. I think this might end up being my first complete collection for a golden child. Because I haven't, I've been buying so many albums, I haven't really been able to work on my photo card collections in terms of like buying new cards. <sighs> Which makes me sad. Cause I used to be very on top of having BTS be complete, but not so much anymore. So it'll be nice to have another complete collection. At least for an album. <laughs> but I'm th I've been thinking about cutting back on my album buying for a lot of groups. And uh, just so I can start buying photo cards and things like that again. But, so I've kind of been putting together a list of groups I'll keep buying. I mean, if it's like a brand new debuting group and I really like their title track and stuff like that, I'll definitely give, you know, their first album a go. 
but I might not, you know, keep buying all their other albums. I might just buy them like on iTunes and things like that. But all right, we have two more left. Two more members. Oop. So we have Ju Chan. Ju Chan. I say their name wrong. I'm sorry. But feel free to correct me in the comments on how to properly say it. Alright, last book, and then it seems there's to be a box with maybe goodies in it. I'm not sure. We have Boomin, I believe is the Makne. Love the blonde hair too. Oop, photo cards. Ooh, look at this kind of semi slicked. Love. hair slicked like that he kind of looks like a like a mob boss <laughs> uh, I don't know if anyone else agrees but that's the vibe I'm kind of getting <laughs> The last item, which is this, I don't know, box, could just be goodies, maybe group photos. Let's see what we got. Oh, ho, ho. Um, so it looks like a folded poster for each member. So, all right, let, let's do this. We'll go in the same order as the photo books. Kind of go sideways with these so you can see it. Thank you. 
Give it a moment to focus. expecting these posters too. Yeah. But oh, it doesn't want to go back in. You can do it. I'm just going to put you in a different spot. That is everything. I hope you guys enjoyed the unboxing of the full set. Um, that kind of is my thing, I guess. I always seem to unbox every versions. I do and I don't like member version photo books and things like that. Um, I mean, I kind of don't mind it as much for smaller groups because it's just financially not as expensive than the full group sets, like large groups. Um, but here's all the, <laughs> all the million photo cards. Um, but let me know your thoughts on, in terms of member version photo books and things like that. Um, I do like it a little bit more when you can pick the members. So, I mean, why is my bias for Golden Child? I do really like quite a few of the members, so getting them all is kind of, you know, a no-brainer for me. But, like, some people really have their bias and don't mind if they have probably a couple others or not. Um, but if it's random, I kind of feel bad if people don't get their biases. <laughs> For photo books and things like that because then you have to take the extra time to trade find someone who's willing to trade or one that you have that someone wants to trade with or you know selling yours so you can buy your biases or something like that so I mean I guess if you can pick who you want or how many you want um, it's not as bad but when it's just like random random or you have to buy the full set I kind of feel like I said a little bit bad but I hope you guys enjoyed this nonetheless. Like, subscribe, and share if you want. And until the next video. Bye guys.